Watching this video assumes that you know how to print a drawing and or a PDF. If you do not know how, please watch the videos in the link below this one first. By default, the option to print the grid lines is disabled. You can enable the option to print the grid lines and change grid line settings by going to Tools, Options, General. In the Grid Options section of the Options dialog box, you'll see two color boxes. The major line color sets the color for a grid lines 10 units of measurement apart, and the minor line color sets the color for grid lines 1 unit of measurement apart. To assign a color to either grid line, click on the color button next to it. Click on a predefined color of your choice, click somewhere inside the color box or move the slider bar to select the color assignment. You may also enter the red, green, and blue values in the associated text boxes. Once you have determined the color, click on the OK button to accept the color assignment. To print the major grid lines to the drawing, ensure that the Print Grid Lines checkbox is enabled. If this box is checked, the major grid lines will always be printed. The option to suppress grid lines closer than blank on the printout enables you to print either only the major grid lines or to include the minor grid lines as well. The minor grid lines represent one unit of measurement. In this example, we have a drawing that is set to a scale of 1 inch equals 10 units. To hide the minor grid lines from printing, we would set the suppress grid lines closer than boxes to a number more than 0.1 inches, since our minor grid lines for this drawing are 0.1 inches apart. Setting this box to 0.09 inches would print the minor grid lines. These numbers could change depending on your paper size and scale. You'll need to experiment to determine which works best for your specific drawing. Depending on the scale of your drawing, minor grid lines may still not be visible at 0.09 inches. You may need to decrease the number further if you truly wish for the minor grid lines to print. For example, if you have a scale of 1 to 50 and you want the minor grid lines to print, a suppression number of 0.01 inches may need to be used. Keep in mind, however, that depending on your paper size, amount of detail in your drawing, and your printer, printing the minor grid lines can drastically affect the quality of your drawing. Most printers cannot render such fine detail, and you could end up making your drawing unreadable. It is not recommended to print the minor grid lines for the majority of drawings.